Now to another facility licensed by the state under scrutiny tonight. Hacienda Healthcare treats medically fragile adults and children across the valley. State leaders were shocked to learn that a woman who was being cared for at the facility gave birth on December the 29th. The woman has been in a vegetative state for more than a decade now. Police want to know who raped her and why no one at the facility knew that she was pregnant until she went into labor. The woman was staying at Hacienda Southeast Care Center near 14th Street and Baseline. Today, Attorney General Mark Burnovich called the incident disgusting and said the state may eventually get involved. Generally speaking, the county attorney has primary just jurisdiction over those types of cases. But um, if you look at our office's record, um, when it's come to cases involving, you know, elder abuse or people that are being abused in uh, vulnerable situations, we've taken the appropriate action. Hacienda Healthcare operates several facilities across the state. It is licensed by the state of Arizona and receives Medicare dollars. The company tells 12 News in a statement they're actively working with Phoenix police and have implemented new safety measures to try to protect patients.